Alright everybody, how's it going out there? Can you believe I'm finally getting to a video here? And I'm finally doing a Yabo video. Look right here. I think the uh, postman tried to peek inside see what was in there. I don't want to show you too much of it because I don't want to show off a bunch of uh, a bunch of addresses or anything. And so, this is from Tom, T.L. Belknap. He sent me an email and said, uh, I don't know, it's been a while back because I've been out of town. And, uh, <clears throat> you know, he did his contest a while back. And he kept saying he was how he was going to do it and he was going to come up with a way. And finally, he just, on one video, said, okay, contest is over. Didn't have to do a VR, didn't have to do a comment, didn't have to do a response. It's just, I drew names. So, and he says, I won his contest. So, anyway, thanks, Tom. I appreciate it. And so, here we go. Let's see, and this has been a long time in the coming because I've been out of town for so long. And so, uh, in here, looks like we have a card. So, that's kind of cool. Can you see that guy there? And I'm sure if you know something about art, you might. And I could, I could read all of that, but... I'm not going to. How's that? He says, Dale, congrats on the win. Enjoy the samples and the other goodies. Look up, but I don't... What am I... What am I looking for, Tom? I don't know. Anyway. So, and then he also put in here one of these Strauss tobacconist uh, little menus, I think is what he calls them. So it has all their blends and uh, sorry guys, kind of what's in there. So, I'm guessing that would mean there's a bunch of Strauss tobaccos in here. Uh, here is the mystery blend. I'm not for sure whether this is one that you made. I remembered when you were making uh, some of yours and just throwing a bunch of them together. And so, this will be a mystery. This smells pretty good. It smells Englishy. Looks like it's got some Latakia in there. Uh, no need to try to rate it because you'll never get it again. Uh, thanks. Let's see what else. Here's Strauss. It looks like Ryland Heights, if I'm reading that correctly. Is that what that is? Ryland Heights? And so, again, I'll look these up and thank you for this. That's going to help tremendously. So, it's got a... It's got a different smell to it. I'm not for sure what it is, to tell you the truth. I don't recognize that. So again, I'll look it up. I'll zip those here in just a minute. Over the Rhine, Strauss Tobacconist. So, and I see another Strauss Tobacconist there on top. It's got a little bit of a sweet smell. It looks like, kind of like a lot of black Cavendish in there. Smells good. That'll be fun to try. Oh, well, here's a couple more. Here's Kentucky Gentleman. Now, oh no, I was Country Gentleman that Cousin Stuffy sent me. This is Kentucky Gentleman. That smells good. Smells, it smells like a lighter Virginia to me. I don't know again. Again, I'm brand new at this. I'm going to make up all these terms. I have no clue. Well, you pick up the flavor of... Okay, this is... Oh, this is Caps Union Terminal. Now, I've heard a lot of people talk about this. They say they've... Or, I don't know about a lot. I've heard a few people say they really like it. So, this will be... And these are... Look at that. These are good-sized samples. I mean, there's at least an ounce in there, if not more than that. Thanks, Tom. Hey, quick commercial break. If you guys are not subscribed to Tom, the TL Bell Map, go do it right now. I'm going to put a link down below in the bucket uh, in, the, in the description. Just pause this video, right-click on that link, open it in a new window, Go to that, or a new tab, whatever. Go to that tab or that window and hit the subscribe button if you're not already. And then leave that tab or window open. Come back. You can finish this video 
As soon as this video is done, then you can go back over there and start watching a bunch of his videos. All right? Everybody done yet? You got some, You better be subscribed to Tom. He's a great guy. So this has got a good smell. I can't describe it any more than that, except it's a good smell. But you know, Tom's one of these guys on YouTube that, after watching just a few of his videos, I can already see us out at the, whatever, the backyard barbecue or in the smoke shop see him for the very first time and you already know each other and so you can strike up a conversation okay here is his house cleaning this is the one these are the ones i remember him doing the house cleaning blend aromatic and that is a there's a at least two ounces if not even more of that in there that may be closer to three ounces in there these are Way generous samples, Tom. These aren't samples. These are... These are... I don't know what you call it. These are full-blown orders. It doesn't smell very, very aromatic-y to me, but maybe it will. And again, if it's got 5 or 10 or 20 or 30 in there, hmm, that'll be interesting to try. Here is... House cleaning, whoops, house cleaning blend English. These are some good baggies, Tom. Smells like about a lot, a lot like the other Englishes. Oh, here is one. The McBaron Dark Twist that Tom really likes. And I've been wanting to try this. And I was going to get some on one of my orders. These little coins or discs, or whatever you call them. I can't get a whole lot from it. Maybe if I... That'll be good. I think I'm really going to like that one. And look at this. Okay, that's all the tobacco. I remember seeing Tom get these things. Or I don't remember whether you got one, whether you got multiples. And I'm going to have to go back and watch your video. This is a little turtle. And if I remember right, it's a speaker. And it lights up uh, on the back and you play music from your, I don't know, from your phone. It looks like it's got an input jack there. I don't know whether it does Bluetooth or not. That's very awesome, Tom. Thank you very much. I'm going to have to go back watch your video. Once I get this working, I'll have to do a video of this guy. His little head moves, his feet move. I don't know whether he'll move around on the tabletop or something. Little paw prints on the bottom. That's cool, Tom. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. That is way cool. So again, I'll go back and watch your watch your video. I can't remember whether you explained how it works or not. If not, I'll go online. Because I remember, it seems like you found the name of them, and you told us what the name of it was, so I can go online and find it. Almost, and I may have shown the addresses. Another little bag of goodies here. Pipe cleaners. You always gotta have pipe cleaners, right? Thanks, Tom. Appreciate it. Never have enough. I say you can never have enough. Maybe if you got five thousand of them. Matches. From Strauss and Cincinnati, Strauss and Cincinnati, and you can always use matches. I have learned in my little pack that I keep with me when I'm out on the road, I keep my Zippo lighter, I keep a couple of disposable lighters, and I keep matches because I have been out there with just my Zippo and run out of fluid before. Then what do you do? So, it's always good to have matches. And... Of course, coming from the Cobb Meister, you, you got to have a cob, right? Missouri Meerschaum, corn cob, and I am so bad with these. I don't know what style, what name, but look at this. You know what? You really can't see that in this video. You can kind of see it if you're comparing here to here. This is quite a bit more yellow than this is. Tom, did you... 
stain it, color it? Did you do something different to it? I have never seen one come that way from uh, Missouri, Missouri Meerschaum. Normally, the cob and this look about the same color. Now, you can see a little bit difference here in the video, but this is really quite a bit more yellow than this. Um, a different color than the amber stem. I'll suck that filter right out of there. Thanks, Tom. I don't know whether, again, I don't know whether you you did that. Let me know whether you colored that or or whether it came that way. I don't know. I've never seen one. And again, it doesn't look hardly yellow at all in this video, but it's it's actually got quite a bit of yellow to it. Thanks, Tom. I appreciate that. You're a great guy, no matter what everybody else says about you. And so I am going to enjoy trying all these tobaccos. Figuring out little Mr. Turtle here and getting him working and getting him going. That's pretty cool. That's awesome. Of course, you got to have matches and tons of pipe cleaners, tons and tons of tobacco. So, and again, thank you so much for putting that in there. Because when I when I do uh, look at tobaccos and stuff, I really try to. I want to know what's in there, and I am learning to what my flavor profile is. So a lot of times I can look at a tobacco and see, oh, it's got this or it's got that in there. And then I know that I'm probably, it's a pretty good chance I'm really gonna like it, so. And I think I'm gonna like probably all of these. And so, thanks Tom, I appreciate it. Are you still hanging around and you did not subscribe to him? You better go subscribe to TL Belknap right now. Don't you let it go by another minute. Go click on it. I'm going to have it in the bucket. If you haven't looked, go in the bucket. Go to his channel and subscribe. If you didn't subscribe to him earlier, click off of this video and go over there and subscribe to him. So anyway, that's it for now, guys. Uh, I'm going to catch you all later. I appreciate everybody watching, all your comments, subscriptions, and I really appreciate you, Tom. Um, I'm going to have to bomb your mailbox back. So thank you very much. I appreciate it. And we'll catch you all next time.